Hey guys, Tennessee Frank here. I got the uh, battery fully charged. Uh, you can see it's at 13.7 volts. And we're going to go ahead and start our capacity test. Um, I think I'm going to run this at 10 amps. And we will just see how long it will run. And uh, we'll see on our screen here what we end up with. I'm um, trying to get this so we're not getting a lot of reflection. Um, let me get the test started. When it's done, we will come back and take a closer look at the screen and see what we get out of this 30 amp hour battery. So, we will be right back. Alright, we're back. That took just a split second for you. It took uh, probably four hours for me. Um, it finally did shut off. And we will take a look at the display here. Let me get down here nice and close if I can. Let me zoom in a little bit. And you can see we ended up with 31.84 amp hours, 398.91 watt hours. That is fantastic out of a 30 amp hour battery. So, I mean, yeah, this thing is definitely uh, punching above its weight there. Yeah, that's, that's good. I would definitely, uh, definitely recommend these batteries. Um, we can go ahead and, since this is done, we can unhook this and get this out of the way. But, um, yeah, definitely eco-worthy. I mean, I, I love their solar panel that I picked up, that uh, 100 watt that was putting out, if you watched my video earlier, it was putting out 23.7 volts um, out of a 100 watt solar panel. And uh, they're still on Amazon right now for about 62 bucks. If you need a good 100 watt solar panel, pick one up. Eco-worthy, definitely a, a company to go for. Um, they're making some good stuff, yeah. Uh, definitely recommend them. So, uh, like I always say, either we stand up for our rights or we can sit by and watch them go away. Y'all have an awesome rest of the day. We'll catch you later. Tennessee Frank out of here.